Now I continue the tutorial with showing how to make the automatic mount on the USB memory. I will make a little bit adjustment, so not actually automatic when you reboot it will mount the USB memory, but it will simplify so you just uh, short down the command for the mounting by putting it in uh, etc fs tab. So once again, we're going to edit the etc fs tab. Last time we were entering the hard disk drive. Now we're going to uh, enter our USB memory. But the difference that we're going to make it mount uh, not, it will not mount when you reboot. Not re It will neither mount when you make a, a mount with a command. So it will only mount when you ask to mount the USB category. So then you do like this. First, the device we want to mount. And uh, then the mount point. And then the file system. And then the permissions. And notice now that, uh, or I would say the file mode, not permissions, file modes, how to open it. And then we don't want it to mount during reboot. So then we add the command the same as for the CD-ROM. You can see two lines up and it's no auto. Uh, since this is a USB memory, I don't want uh, to have a dump on it. Uh, I don't neither. I, since I don't, I will not have it uh, mounted during startup. So I pass this one in the uh, so it will not be integrity checked during startup, so I add a zero here. I forgot to mention one thing. You do not need to put any pass priority to make an integrity check on, um, uh, for example, on a swap or read only mountings, because it's only on file system you make a writing on that will be uh, mounted on startup. However, this should be enough. And uh, now we try if it functions. So what this will do now is that this won't or should not mount. If I make mount A, which will mount everything in FSTub, it will skip the USB memory since this USB memory has the no auto option. So if we check in USB memory folder, it's not mounted there. So that's what I wanted. Because uh, when I reboot, I won't get my USB memory automatically mounted. But th the difference is now, since I have it in FSTub, I can make like this. Mount USB memory. So mount and the mounting point. And if I look inside of the USB memory, it's mounted there. It's very simple, isn't it? Very good. And that's exactly what I wanted. So now if I make a quick reboot, just to show you, we should have the disk, my disk, mounted, and we should uh, not have the USB memory mounted. So while this reboot, I would like to say that if you're not familiar with the FreeBSD uh, file system, or not, uh, sorry, not the file system, but the way to handle the partitions and the disk names, uh, you can check out the uh, under my tutorials that we have uh, uh, adva under, under advanced installation. You find how to mount and information about how they uh, care, how FreeBSD care about the driving names, and so you, what you expect if you use USB memory, what you expect for IDE or SATA disk. So um, there you can find information about it. So now our system is good to go. So let's check the first thing. The USB memory should not be mounted. It's not. And uh, my disk should be mounted. And it's mounted. Exactly how we wanted it to be. So this is the way you make a mounting in FreeBSD.